Okay, so you guys like us. Mm. What's, what's exactly your problem with you? Uh-uh. What's wrong with you? What's wrong with you? Why are we so feisty today, Nobu? I'm not feisty. I'm so feisty. That's not my head. Okay. Wow. That's why, that's why you have, you have. Anyway, welcome to another exciting episode of Shade Corner. So guys, today on Shade Corner, we have a very special guest. So um, some of you may know, we had a bit of a competition on our social media page at Accelerate TV. And we asked you guys to let us know why you'd like to be on the show. And here we have the winner of our little Ooh. competition, Dobra Britibe. Thank you. Thank you for having me here today. <laughs> you, know, you know, the show is about Nollywood, so you have to give the fake accent. <laughs> yeah, very tell you what we're talking about anyway. But we're talking about Nollywood, and Nollywood is our favorite topic. We cannot get enough of Nollywood, so we're talking about Nollywood again. But today, our spin on Nollywood is where we're talking about I'll tell you, okay. It's <laughs> happening beside me and I'm afraid. Guys, Tamara is going mad. <laughs> I'm very scared, I can't lie. <laughs> I'm very afraid. <laughs> okay, like I was saying, the, today, what are, the spin we're putting on Nollywood is that we're going to talk about movies going to the cinemas. Mm. Okay, so, like, Dobra, what's one of the big cinema movies you've seen in the last year? So, really? so, so this year, I think sometime in February, my favorite all-time Nigerian movie was She Is. <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 I'm joking. Like, I can't even see the face. I can't. She is. So she I literally, is. like about nine people told me don't watch that movie. Yeah, same. I went ahead, watched it. Technically, I haven't watched it because halfway through, I slept. Why? Well, <laughs> she is not. Yeah. No, but you think, you know the funny thing, I saw that movie as well. And for me, what bothered me, other than the fact that it was in, it was on Women's Month, I think. It was like yeah. International, yeah. Women's International Women's, Women's Month. Mm. It was the movie. The, she is. You think that it was about this girl. This she is a warrior. She is a strong woman. It was very very strange. The plot was weird. She was basically trying yeah. to have a child because she couldn't get married, and it was just going. And then the cameras. I think I was confused. I can't lie. The only I good think... thing that came from that. Sorry, I'm sorry. No, no, the only same. good thing that came from that movie was the song. I think one of the singers. Oh <laughs> yes, the song was, the song was amazing. Apart from mm. that, like. mm -hmm. I mean, Waji and Omaomi have amazing voices, so they killed it with the music. But I think mm. the movie was misdirected. To be honest, at some point, I remember that it was like we're using a professional camera, mm. and during the time, maybe they took like so, it now changed to iPhone. <laughs> <laughs> so the screen, you know, it was looking different. Screen, everything was just different. Mm -hmm. Then. The, I, it was supposed to be for women, but it felt like the movie was against women. It was very much so, so. It just, I was, when I came out of the cinema, you know, I was feeling pain and you know, a lot of ish, emotions. <laughs> and then some women outside were like, this is hurtful! This, woman, this is not about women, I'm so angry! And I know. Like, okay, well, if yeah, women are saying really this, then... About it. Like, what, what is, is it that they're, they're getting wrong? wrong? Like, what is it they're getting wrong? I feel like we finally reached the point where we're getting, like, the actual look and feel wrong. So when people get, like, the look of a movie wrong, that's just a shitty movie. Mm -hmm. That's just a bad... Because we can make, like, we have the cameras, we have all the equipment. There's... I can't remember the last time I watched a Nigerian film where the story made any sense. I think no, so. I've watched Nigerian movies that had that, but I think the problem is that no. they it's don't the realize story. that not, not everyone has to be in the cinema. Uh, you yeah. don't have to take every movie. She, she should yeah. have been a home video. Some, some of those cinema screens, like it's the visiting. camera is different. Yeah. Like it's not, you yeah. don't just put any movie that you have in the you know, place. But that's the point, but if it's a cinema movie. About yeah. Her, she was like, yo, um, not every cinema, not every Nigerian movie, movie, movie should, be. should be in cinemas. But isn't it movies, movies in the cinema we're talking about? People no, people her. attacked her and then she now said, no, actually, even movies that I'm in. But what she said wasn't wrong. I 100% agree with her because to me, a lot of Nigerian movies are lazy. There's, 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 there's hardly any depth, and the thing That's is, what I mean with this story. I, most lazy. of the time, when I watch Nigerian movies, I watch them ironically, and I'm not yeah. even trying to be sure. I watch them to like laugh. I mean, this one girl, she has a weave. Ten years later, she has the same weave. Yeah. Oh. 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 Or there's this Nigerian horror movie I watched about a haunted house. There was a ghost, and the guy was in like a cape, <laughs> and and um, 
That's right. So I just lost my trust. <laughs> <laughs> that just happened. Yeah. 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 To some extent, sometimes. I can't blame them. Nobody's. There's no money in these movies. Like, if there's like a hundred million naira, no, but then, you know, they so also no, they're going to the cinema. No, they, they also inflate That's the movie the People just hurry up and they create the film with whatever they can and then make the money off it. Nobody is like. No, but even that money, like even that money that they make. Even that money that they make, they inflate the numbers a lot yeah, of the time. So you think that the movie is making so yes, much money? Yes, and it's not. But it's not. There was a producer that came out, um, Udwa Kisong, and she said that the only movie this year that has made over 20 million naira yeah. is Hire a Woman, which I don't understand why it made that much money because it made. How about Chief Daddy? Watched it. Have you seen the preview? No, I didn't. <laughs> yeah, woman. I, like, I wouldn't watch it. How about Chief Daddy? Did, 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 didn't Chief Daddy, like I heard Chief Daddy did pretty I'm decent. 500 stuff. plus million. Yeah, 500 million, but I don't know who she's shading, so I can't say he did that much. Because right now, everybody's in. I the, have to yeah. say, there's a very big production company. I won't say who because I'm scared they'll say me. <laughs> but they lie about their numbers. Because mm. I know their numbers. No, okay. And so they, I know the numbers they release. How much money? So I. Correct me if I'm wrong. So I think, okay, a movie might have made 500, but not from the, from the cinema. cinema. No, yeah. they make but 500. Cinema, no, but then where would they make it from? from? Private viewings, compare money that their friends Who pays for private viewings? They spend no, money for the private viewings. People have private viewings. I know people that do that. They don't pay two million dollars to bring it to their house. To bring it to their house. I know people that do that. But do people actually pay that much, two million for private viewings? Yes, companies even Nigerians love to be rich. Yeah, companies, yes. Yes, all companies. And they host their staff to watch it. Yeah, they do that. Yes. Do it. So, I mean, so all that money compiled together, plus ad, so ad placements, I think, you know, all that money should just... Speaking of ad placements, I'm going to share your movie. The <laughs> Cold Stone Advertising. At one point, the ghost went to eat ice cream. <laughs> oh, <yeah. laughs> you know, that one's not even as bad as the one when they started showing the different products. Happy. I didn't mind yeah, Shabby because yeah. they oh, also did great things. velvets. Thanks, guys. Uh, <laughs> so, At one point, you were sold in bad. Yeah, we've segued yeah. to product placement now. Yeah, so sorry, that's sorry. Sorry. Product placement in movies is ridiculous, obviously. Mm -hmm. yes. We do a lot of it. Like, I was watching this movie where it was, I think it was a soap brand that was sponsoring the movie, mm -hmm. and they had an entire scene dedicated to talking about the different, oh, yeah. wow, I use this soap to shower. It yeah. makes my skin very fresh. And it was not a proper scene well, not in their the movie. Fault. I know the best part. It was a Yoruba movie. Ah! So, so was they did all of this in Yoruba. Yeah. But Chief Daddy. <laughs> oh. The shameless product placement at the end. I, I never watched it. I never watched it. At different, oh. point, at different points, like just random people will come from the company and just talk. And then at the end of the movie, there was not this part. They were trying to get them to open an account and they were just like, okay, she's built in form. The person gave like, me like, money, me too, if I do film tomorrow. No, but then, even no, if it's no. Access Bank, Tamara, at the end, that we both have Tamara, Tamara, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. No. Access Bank sponsors this show. No. And, where? where? Hmm. Where is the place? But I never went like that. No, Tamara is watching access right? bank airing. If you look closer, you see access <laughs> bank. <laughs> no, no, but, but this one, they literally went through each thing that they were offering the bank. I'm like, oh, f mm, oh my that's a bank. bank. Mm. As in, don't mind them, but to open an account, don't please click the link here. right here. <laughs> <laughs> okay, guys, now, I can already started talking about this, but what do you guys think are some of the reasons why some of these movies are not great? Like, other than. The bad production, is it the story, the crew, the, the story, cast, like, what the exactly? production, Laziness. a lack of money, sorry, the acting, <laughs> the editing, everything. The fingers are finished. And to be honest, <laughs> you guys too. You guys. No, 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 the no, is, no. Mm, the market is ready. Let me explain myself. Okay. If the, market, explain. if the market is constantly consuming a particular kind of content, as a producer and a businessman, we we'll continue to give it to them. I mean, I know that we, everybody and the critics have been telling this that doesn't movie make sense. producer 30 days in this, 30 days in that, 30 days. Mm. Oh, God, change, make it better, make it because you have the opportunity with some other people, if you mm. producers too, get this kind of feedback and this kind of, you know, um, mm? patronage what are you talking from about? the viewers. <laughs> change the kind of movies you're making, make it better. But that. no, why would he change it? He said that this formula works. People are eating. But based he's on talking about, he's talking about the 30 I days in Jamaica. As as days oh. in from it, you will keep but that's so true, and I hate when. But, uh, but I get why producers. I, a lot of people it. actually tell that to me because I write, mm. and a lot of um, producers are like, "Oh, why are you trying to do this and do that?" And it's, it seems so stupid. And I to me. Well, Have you seen Nigerian like, cinemas when is, when Marvel the movies come out, when uh, all these other foreign movies the come out? But the market wants these things. Y'all are just lazy. The market wants other things. My solution is to be your Are we enough? Pardon? The market that wants something else, you and I, and you know, if you... It's not you and I, it's everybody! So, is it, if, you give, if you give it, if you give it, people Please, will I can't hear anybody, one. Nigerians want entertainment. Mm -hmm. They just Here want to are. be entertained. If they can go and watch us 
that strange movie that even me, I was like, I, I don't love understand. It. But I like, I loved it. If they can go and watch it, that cinema was packed. So how can a Nigerian producer say, hey, it's only 30 days in uh, Kazakhstan? It is because they are lazy. lazy. It's it's lazy. Because it's they are lazy. lazy. My, my, my point is that everybody has a role in making Hollywood better. The people who are watching it have but to demand for better. But, but it's up to the producers to change it at all. No, wait, wait. Okay. I'm no, sorry. I'm sorry. You, you saying, you saying that, oh, because everybody is accepting this and whatever is very very lazy it is up to the producer to think outside the no, box and deliver something and that is give difficult like because go watch like what like, 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 like what 70 c we watched the watch movie. Movie. So he did it make money. Oh, so no, 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 the numbers that they made, they were real about it. And so people went to watch it, just that they are not ready to lie. So, and that's fine. And so I feel like people are... disproving my point? No, we're not disproving, but so what, I, I, what I'm saying... Aka, no, my point is that you are, you are saying that the people are not supporting good movies. So the people in, don't have a No, people are supporting... No, Aka, people, Aka, people are going to watch these movies, good or bad. But Aka, you can't use mediocrity... You can't use people accepting mediocrity as a basis to then to make continue mediocre to deliver movies. mediocrity. That's ridiculous. Exactly. Exactly. The truth is, in a business place, there will always be those who. But you're looking at movie making as a business. See, see, that's what I'm saying, and that's um, that's why I said some of these movie producers are coming from a business standpoint. Okay. Because, because they, they have investors. Okay. I'm not saying everything. They have investors. They have investors that they have to also okay. The also, there are people who will provide what the market wants, and there are people who will now tell or educate the market on what they should want. So, Aka, what should the audience do? Everyone has a role to play. What should the audience do? We need to start demanding better. We need to start having a better marketing strategy mm. and plan. We need to have better PR companies. We need mm. to have better scripts. Because the truth is that some people, their job is to water down scripts. Sometimes mm. the writer will bring a good script. The director will bring down the script. Okay, my point is, what should the people do? That's so, what I'm asking you. It's not just the people. Mm. My point is, everyone has a role to play for Nollywood to be better. Do you understand what I'm saying? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I understand that. Better. They should, mm. I mean, call it, like, if a movie is bullshit, let don't go and watch like, it. Don't, go and, don't support it. Okay. Don't go and shout mm. or scream. But how do you know if support, it's bullshit when you haven't watched it? Support mediocre. Mm. Do you mm. know? No, there are people who go and say, oh, this movie is great. Go and watch it. Go and watch it. Yeah. So, I mean, there, like I said, there will always be producers who create movies for the existing market and what the market wants. So, until that phase or that market evolves, they're not going to evolve. There are some people who will now mm. push for the market to, to My simple the counter there. argument is that that's a lazy excuse producers give because as we are saying, people will watch anything. Yeah, they will watch Any anything. Even they if watch movies in America, the ones they that have 10% of Rotten Tomatoes, people are watching. Yes, yes. yes. there's yes. only, there's, there's, there's well, especially but in Nigeria, it's not like we have too much here. So, okay, you bottom line, line, bottom line the producers yeah. should think outside the box and exactly. give us something new because a lot it's of us end users. And the consumers. Well. Yeah. Yeah. Consumers. Plenty of us might not know that we need these them. outside the box movies. So. Mm -hmm. yeah, okay, guys, okay, okay, guys, moving on. Moving on, moving on. What do you guys think about like budgeting as well for these movies? Because oh, a lot oh. of them. Is that the, what, what I think affects them is the low budget. Maybe yes. either that they've given the budget and then somebody has spent the money, yes. Yes. or they've distributed the money before even using the money to spend, yes. or they've just not have had enough of a budget. Mm. I mean, can you relate to this? I As mean, a writer, the money you people offer me, if I got punished already. <laughs> somebody once said I should write a movie, a big blockbuster movie. I will not call the name here because luckily you didn't even do well, so there's no need for me to give you extra clout. Mm -hmm. They said I should come and write it. Sixty thousand naira. Oh wow. <laughs> 60,000 naira to write a movie. That's why God made your movie a dustbin. <laughs> <laughs> okay, don't worry. What do you have to say? What do you have to say about so, from, so, so, through the grapevine, I heard this story. I mean, you hear things all the time with Nigerian movies. And there's this one I heard about this one popular Nigerian producer who was given amount X for a budget and mm. decided to squander that amount on his own personal mm. whatever I, 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 uh, so i personally don't know the person this is a story i heard <laughs> on the streets where i'm from thank you very much you. but, so but, well, but yeah so, so so pretty much that's why i heard that this person said person squandered the money and apparently lots of nollywood actors and actually got involved and he was beat up and stuff i'm, I'm not sure if you guys have, have heard this story and and i think there was something about masturbation as well i'm not sure please if you guys have heard please oh, wow. let us know the story is that wow. he was in a hotel room that he had not paid for or he had paid for with production money and he was they came and they were like knocking on the door give us our money i wasn't there but in my mind I'm like come us give us our money and when they eventually broke the door down with the battering ram that they had brought i really wasn't there so that's not what you can have wow that's what they told me i was no, not I there feel, i feel like if that happened somebody would have filmed it 
And I've been out. Have you know there's no, there's no video? There's no secret video please, online. Please, this is, not, this is not exposure. This is ah. not TMZ. Please. Well, my own thing is, okay, but you know, I have an issue with Nigerian actors and actresses. Because a lot of the time, when things like this happen, we'll hear from the grapevine, but nobody ever comes, comes to life yes. to talk about it. So then somebody who you is... Know, as I'm saying this no, right wait, now, man. I can already see all my friends are going to be like, ah, you clearly don't want money again. You can't. You no, can't no, 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 you can't. You can't say something about it. Because a lot of these actors are never. sometimes hold on. Some of these actors are bigger than the producer, so they can't talk about it. You can't say that, oh, this producer did so, so if it's something that messy, somebody should be talking about it somewhere so that me mm -hmm. as a young actor will not go and think that this producer will help me one day. But that's why or, so many of them get dropped. Which is the point but I'm trying to make. Don't talk, talk about it. They actors, won't. expose the industry. They won't. Expose it. If they're not giving you money, expose it. Tell us they're giving you 10k when they, they should be giving you 100k. I don't talk know about it. Said, you know how difficult I'm considered in the industry just because when somebody's doing nonsense, I call them out, I will say something. It's, it's good. I'm it's so difficult. I'm so horrible. If you ask for better, if you you know, want proper standards or mm -hmm. you see somebody's not doing their job right or you want actual professionalism you will label me Baka, you've been Are doing you, that, aren't you still here? I'm still here no, I know the but, you know, so Nigerians have a problem with people who like who quality stand up. Mm -hmm. like if you stand yes. up or whatever ah, this one yes. is bad belly, yeah. this one is a yes. hater and I think that it's really up to all these people to really change that because mm -hmm. it's terrible if somebody can chop millions of naira because of a movie that person should be called out like, mm. there's really no Finish. need why it wasn't on Tell Insta Blog Ninja yeah, shame the person, know. you're crazy I, I actually have never heard this just I heard it, I heard it and now that I've heard it, you guys believe I'm going to say it everywhere you guys, okay, so what movies would you say in fact, this is not even this year, just generally. What movies have you seen in the cinema from Nollywood that you said, okay, this is a cinema movie, this was worth my money, worth my time? What movies can you think Black of? Black Panther. Uh -uh. <laughs> what kind of girl is this, please? Well, please, oh, Nigeria. Well, mostly black like people, so it might as well be a Nigerian. The child is not from no, Africa. No, Wakanda is Africa, it's Nigeria. Nigeria. So, so Nigeria. Where, where is it? Where is it? It's in Ogun State. Go and build your house there. Because he didn't tap the red bush, you know it's covered. Yes. Black Panther is a Nigerian movie. We're all in Nigeria. When the movie came out, I said, you people, please. Even when I went to go and buy the ticket, the mama was sending me popcorn. She said, Wakanda. I said, I said, I beg, I beg, give me my popcorn. <laughs> what more said, what Wakanda was? I like Oju Kokoro. That was a good one. I love Oju Kokoro. Yeah, that was a good one. That was a good one. I heard good reviews though. Mm -hmm. yeah. Aka, what about you? Uh, things <laughs> fall apart. Oh, there was, was a movie on that? Was that in cinema? There was a movie on Things Fall Apart. That wasn't made by Nigerians. Call the one that Nigerians something. Made, no, no, today, no, 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 no. No, no, no. Nigerians did make kids. No, but yeah. he's making the sense. Was, okay, then Black Panther movie? stands now. Have you seen the that cinema one is the premise. that you went to go and watch? Not any that you watch in the cinema from Nollywood. Yes, you know you watch in the Nollywood, cinema. not Holly Nollywood. Uh, uh, no, um, there's none. <laughs> <laughs> No, I can't the actor, so it's him that will know. So. No. I can't even say, but I don't know about your movie. I don't know about your movie. That was a good movie, minus some amazing problems. Movie. Yeah. Yeah. B.I.G. Yeah. It was yeah, okay, I it was B. cool. I, 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 I laughed. I did not like the car scene, oh, but let's not get into that. You guys, what about Sylvia? Sylvia. Sylvia. I love it. I enjoyed Sylvia. I did not love it because of one simple problem. The movie was happening, things were going on. It was the story. Like, story was, why on earth was this man in her dreams? Nobody explained it. Like many Nigerians. Just casually, they're I, just I think a messy movie. Yeah, 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 don't you live yeah, in Nigeria? Yeah. Uh, uh, oh, I'm sorry, wait, you wait, all have spirit wives. Wait, 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 I'm is it like a, of, I'm like a, um, yeah. I'm not there. Obanje. <laughs> yeah, basically. Yeah, like, oh, Obanje is not. That's how Obanje is. No, she was like, she was seeing this guy in her dream, or he was seeing this girl in his dreams. Yeah. And she was basically, it wasn't, it wasn't his period, but they fell in love. But did they have children? She was meant to be. No. No, no, no. Well, was she sleeping with the ghost? Yes, uh, more or less, to be honest. Basically, yes. She now somehow, again, another plot point that didn't really make sense. She came to the real, she came to the real world. Did Nobody explained how. No, but, no, but, no, but, 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 but I enjoyed myself. I can think of it from, a, more, from, a, from a religious point of view. This, the demon that was in the gym. Also, nobody said with, blood of Jesus then developed, was in that film. Then That's not reality. Then for a Nigerian film, <laughs> nobody said Jesus. Not once. Come off it. Come off okay, it. Okay, you guys. You anyway, guys. I'm not talking again. I'm tired. But I, I like Sylvia. We have tried. I was 
Okay, Dobra, how about you? What movie have you seen in the cinema recently that you really liked? Okay, so not cinema, but I saw Lionheart recently on Netflix. And to be fair, I actually went to cinemas for like a weekend. Yeah. Ah, yeah, I did. Yeah. Was it a good movie? So, 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 so I thought it was one of the better ones, but it was still pretty average in my opinion. Like mm. the cinematography, all that was beautiful. It was, it was a full And I loved the transition from, from Igbo the and whatever, and because I'm half Igbo, it was just, I, I was just relating yeah, my mom. Really it's true. Was <laughs> Thank you. We'll, Love we'll, connections and shit. We'll discuss. <laughs> but, however, I still feel like Lionheart lacked depth that a lot of so called good Nigerian movies. Yeah. It was just literally a girl who her father was yeah. earning money yeah. and she just had to go and borrow money or something weird like that. It felt and like an me, American series to me. It felt like an, an Amer- like something a low budget like American series. You know what I was saying? It felt complete in a sense. Maybe not. It, there were no. I feel like there were no highlights. There were no felt, highlights. It was very. It felt one-nose. like it, should, it ended where it was supposed to end. Maybe it started where it was supposed to start. Risk. I think that that's what it was. They didn't want to take mm. risks. It was complete. It felt nice. But I don't think I'll watch it again. But would you have watched it in the cinema? I wouldn't watch it in <laughs> say at. I won't watch it in the cinema. Yeah. Wow. I wouldn't. But I would watch wow. it on Netflix. Okay. But but I, but but I love Genevieve. Genevieve. I love Genevieve. I've watched it. Oh, you have, yes, sorry, I just said it's complete. King of Boys. King of Boys. If they cut it a little bit, it's perfect. Yeah, it's three hours. Yeah, it was a cut version. Yeah, the three hours one is a cut version. Wow. But it was beautiful. Oh, you know what I liked? It's okay. Oh, okay. was good. I'm, I'm actually, I always say I'm over wedding movies. I don't want to watch another oh, wedding movie in my wow. life. Oh my god, I'm, a, I'm waiting for wedding party three. Yeah. Woo! Is it like a bed? Okay, no, we're no. good. <laughs> Alright guys, so thank you so much for watching Shade Corner today. Dobra, I hope you had a lovely I time. I had an us. amazing, I had a blast. Thank you for having me here. So today. next time I'm doing a competition, I better go and enter a competition so you can be here. <laughs> exactly. Take a hang out with us. Well, yes, thank you for watching Woo! Shade Corner. I will see you next week. Hello! If you just enjoyed what you watched, subscribe to Accelerate TV for more of it. Click the button right there. I want to say I'm waiting, but I'm not. I have other things to do.